हॅलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सपना झोनस्कुलिंग चॅनल नमस्कार विद्यार्थी मित्र मैत्रिणींनो स्वागत आहे तुम्हा सर्वांचं सपना झोनस्कुलिंग या चॅनलमध्ये आज आपण सायन्स अँड सायन्स अँड टेक्नॉलॉजी पार्ट टूचा फोर्थ लेसन एन्व्हायरमेंटल मॅनेजमेंटची एक्सरसाइज पाहत आहोत तर चला आपल्या व्हिडिओला सुरुवात करूया फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन रेकॉगनाइज द फॉलोइंग फूड चेन डिस्क्राईब द इकोसिस्टम टू विच इट बिलॉंग्स आज पॅडीफिल्ड ग्रास हॉपर फ्रॉग स्नेक इगल ही बरोबर आपली साखळी आहे पॅडीफिल्ड रिप्रेझेंट द प्रायमरी प्रोड्युसर विच आर प्लांट्स ग्रास हॉपर इज द प्रायमरी कन्झ्युम प्रायमरी इन कन्झ्युम असा ऑर्गॅनिझम्स दॅट ईट द प्रायमरी प्रोड्युसर्स अँड आर युजली हर्बो हर्बायवर्स फ्रॉग इज अ सेकेंडरी कन्झ्युमर सेकेंडरी कन्झ्युमर्स आर ऑर्गॅनिझम दॅट ईट द प्रायमरी कन्झ्युमर्स अँड जनरली मीट इटर्स ऑर कार्निवर्स स्नेक इज अ टेरिटरी कन्झ्युमर टेरिटरी कन्झ्युमर्स आर ऑर्गॅनिझम दॅट ईट द सेकेंडरी कन्झ्युमर दिस ऑर्गॅनिझम्स आर कार्निवोर ईटिंग कार्निवोर्स लाईक स्नेक ऑर बिग फिश इगल इज अ कॉन्टेंट कॉन्टेनरी कन्झ्युमर अँड इन दिस केस इट इज द ॲपिक्स कन्झ्युमर बिकॉज इट ऑक्युपाय इज द हायस्ट पोझिशन इन द फूड चेन क्वेश्चन टू एक्सप्लेन द स्टेटमेंट वी हॅव गॉट दिस अर्थ प्लॅनेट ऑन प्लीज फ्रॉम आर फ्युचर जनरेशन अँड नॉट ॲज अन Uh, ancestral property from our ancestors the above statement refers to the fact that the earth belongs to everyone from an ancestor to our future generations it indicates towards the point that the plant earth planet earth should be protected and conserved in the same way as by our ancestors so that it can be passed on our same future generations it highlights on underlying problems which is the over exploitation of resource by the pers- present generation which could eventually lead to the destruction of life on earth the planet earth can be protected for future generations by following the path of sustainable development sustainable development means the development should be such that it can be sustained for longer period of time and must cater to the needs of the coming generations it is mostly used in terms of the non renewable sources of energy which faced uh, depletion because of overuse by human beings sustainable development seeks to promote a just uh, judicious use of non renewable energy sources such as coal and petroleum so that they do not get depleted Bo- beforehand and our future generations do not have these resources at their disposal sustainable development thus means developing in such way that not only our present but our future is also secured question 3 write short notes on environmental conservation environmental conservation is a broad term which refers to the action we take in order to protect a planet and conserves its natural resource we are very well aware of the fact that the human life on earth is supported by the various components of the environment there is a direct relationship between environment and life on earth any kind of harm or disruption of or to the environment will directly and indirectly affect the life of organisms on this earth we need to understand that our natural resources should be used in a sustainable manner and not to fulfill our greeds environmental conservation implies to the conservation of forest water resources mineral resources etc there are various projects which are being carried out at different levels with respect to environment conservation these programs are carried out by government organizations ngos raw schools college etc the aim of this programs is to promote the conservation of environment from the grassroots level b chipko movement of vishnoi the chipko movement uh, started in the 1970s the in gharwal uh, in uttarakhand it was a socio ecological movement which followed the gandhian ideology of satyagraha for the protection of trees from cutting chipko in hindi literally means to stick under the movement people used to hug the trees in order to 
protect them from being filled. The movement mobilized villagers by making them aware of the after effects of destruction of forests. It was a great success and soon spread all over India. It was because of Chipko movement that the government of India realized the importance of formulating wildlife conservation plans and politics policies in order to protect the biodiversity of the country. See biodiversity. Biodiversity refers to the combined diversity at all levels of biological organization. It includes genetic diversity, species diversity, and ecological diversity. Importance of biodiversity. A. A wide range of materials such as fibers, dyes, resin are obtained from plants. A variety of plants and animals are utilized as source of food. Medicinal plants act as source of drugs. Plants and animals also have a cultural and a aesthetic value. D. Sacred groves. The sacred groves are forest fragments which are highly protected by certain communities between because they are of religious importance to the communities. This can be considered as sanctuaries which are protected by the society and not by the government organization. More than 13,000 sacred groves have been identified all over India. Disaster and its management First, to save human life from disaster, to help them for moving away from the place of disaster by rapid action, to supply essential commodities to the affected people. This helps to reduce the gravity of disaster. People are given grains, water, clothes and other basic necessities under the objective. To bring back the conditions of affected people to normality, to rehabilitate the effect and displaced victims, to th think and execute the protective measure in order to develop capability to face the disaster in future. Question 4. How will you justify that overcoming the pollution is a powerful way of environmental management? We know that the major cause of environmental damage is pollution. Pollution of air, water bodies, soil, etc. all contribute to various environmental problems. The continuous increase in pollution has made the environment nearly unfit for us. This can largely be attributed to the rapid rate at which trees are being cut. In this absence of trees, the level of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere increases, adding the problem of global warming. Moreover, the emission of carbon monoxide, hydrocarbons and other such gases from vehicles and factories are rapidly polluting the air, making it even difficult to breathe. Pollution of water bodies have resulted in the death of aquatic life and making most of the water bodies unfit for human and animal use. All of our above points are highlighted in the fact that pollution is one of the causes and environmental degradation, environmental management can help us solve this issue by efficiently managing the problems associated with pollution. We need to remember that the nature is treasure which needs to be preserved, preserved for our own survival. If we do not pay attention to this problem and make efforts to preserve our environment, this wonderful earth would soon cease to exist. Question 5. Which projects will you run in relation to environmental conservation? How? Answer. Environmental conservation is a broad term which refers to the action we take in order to protect our planet and conserve its natural resources. Environment conservation can have various components like conservation of forest, conservation of water, resources, etc. These are various projects which can be carried out to conserve our environment. Water conservation. Conservation of water is a of utmost importance of human survival because almost all forms of life depend on water. Conservation of water is essential for securing food grade production and sustaining various life forms. In order to conserve water, we can run programs on various levels of being awareness about water conservation and its method. The most talked about method is rainwater harvesting. We can persuade people to practice rainwater harvesting and the government can provide loans and expert advice for this purpose. Forest Conservation 
forest conservation not only deals with conservation of trees of a forest but it also applies to the protection of wildlife which exists there forests are a huge resource of wood and other products which is why they are exploited at a greater scale with order to protect forest government and the public needs to work in harmony we need to start projects which but aimed at recycling of products like paper etc so that the less of trees are cut down we need to take responsibilities that less of forest cover is destroyed by for urbanization urbanization project we need to start projects which highlight the importance of sustainable development and how we can achieve that question 6 answer the following a write the factors affected environment answer the factor which affect the environment are grouped into two categories biotic and abiotic factors biotic factors refer to the living components of ecosystem like animals and plants and abiotic factors refer to the non living components of an ecosystem for example sunlight temperature air etc the biotic and abiotic factors together affect the environment as both are connected to each other abiotic factors are required for the existence and survival of organism b why does the human beings have importance place in environment answer there is an interrelationship between humans and environment which means humans and environment are interconnected this existence of humans is not possible without striking a balance with the environment you must develop way of ways to use the natural sources for their existence however when they need turn into greed it resulted in over exploitation of resources over exploitation of resources by humans have treated the existence of other species as well resulting in their extinction various problems like global warming change weather patterns water scarcity etc are results of human activities this problems highlight the fact that how important is the role of humans with respect to environment if human activities are controlled and an effort is made to make harmony with the nature it is most probable we can revert these environmental changes if we fail to do so it could have devastating effect write the types of example of biodiversity as a there are three types of biodiversity which are as follows first is uh, genetic diversity genetic diversity refers to the diversity which occurs among the organisms of same species for example the diversity which is among found among humans each human is being different from another species universe uh, diversity species diversity refers to the innumerable species of uh, organisms which are found in nat- nature ranging from plants animals to microbes ecosystem diversity ecosystem diversity refers to the various kinds of ecosystem which are found in the region each ecosystem will have its own characteristics plants animals abiotic factors etc d how the biodiversity can be conserved answer two approaches followed for the conservation of biodiversity are inside in conservation in order to conserve biodiversity better biodiversity hotspots all around the world have been identified and protected in india biosphere reserves wildlife sanctuaries and national parks have been developed for this purpose exeru is conservation the threatened species of, of plants and animals are taken out of their habitats and kept in special settings such as zoological parks botanical garden and wildlife parks now it is the gametes of endangered species can be preserved by methods such as cryo preservation and they can also be fertilized in way of follower by propagation through tissue cultural methods similarly seeds can be preserved in seed banks e what do we learn from the story of zado molai pam As a Zado Mulai Payang was a nomadic tribe born in Assam. There is a jungle which has been named on his named honored his hard work. After a flood affected the areas of Assam, Zado started a reforestation process by planting twenty bamboo plants. This initiative was the supported by Assam government with the hard work of Zado and the government.
द बैरन एरिया विटनेस द फॉरेस्ट कवर ओवर द वन थाउजेंड थ्री हंड्रेड सिक्सटी एक्ट्रेस हिज कॉन्ट्रीब्यूशन ऑफ द एनवायरमेंट टू द एनवायरमेंट वॉज एक्नॉल्ड बाय ऑदरिंग विथ हिम द पद्मश्री अवार्ड हिज स्टोरी गिव्स अस अ मैसेज दैट अ सिंगल पर्सन कैन ब्रिंग अबाउट अ बिग चेंज एंड इट इज इन द विल विच इज द रिक्वायर्ड टू डू सो एफ राइट द नेम्स ऑफ बायोडाइवर्सिटी हॉटस्पॉट answer biodiversity hotspots are regions with high species richness and higher degree of uh, endemism endemism is in the indigenous of species to a particular region western ghat sri lanka himalaya and indo burma are the high biodiversity regions that cover india g which are the reason of endangering the many species of plants and animals how can we save those also the animals and plant species are endangered majorly due to man made cause some natural disaster like earthquakes climate change forest fire drought and cyclones also affect the living organism due to lack of food and water in man made causes hunting and poaching are the main reason Also, animal-human conflicts occur due to the invasion of human settlements into the habitat of wild animals. Construction of dam, roads, and colonies destroy the habitats of wildlife. Industrialization, urbanization, and population explosion of humans are putting severe pressure on all the existing biodiversity. In order to save all the protect the biodiversity, may scientists and naturalists come together. A stretch of land is protected by declaring it is a sanctuary or a national park by government even the locals can protect it as a sacred grove eight various actions rules have been formulated to protect the organism the violators of such rules are punished accordingly seventh question what are the meaning of following symbol write in your role accordingly so yes yeah, uttar so hai reduce reuse and recycle pada so uttar hai save water yes so uttar hai use of solar energy सर जो दुसऱ्याच जे उत्तर होतं ते सिम्बॉल इनक्यू इनक्यू इनक्यूकेट द इम्पॉर्टन्स ऑफ बिंग इको फ्रेंडली द फर्स्ट सिम्बॉल इज एसेन्शियल टू मेंटेन द नॅचरल रिसोर्सेस बाय रिव्ह्युजिंग अँड रिसायक्लिंग दॅम एज फार एज पॉसिबल वन शूड रिड्यूस द एक्सेसिव्ह यूज ऑफ रिसोर्सेस बाय प्रिव्हेंटिंग कन्झ्युमरीज वॉट आर प्रॉब्लेम्स प्रसिस्ट मे इन मेजर सिटीज अँड विलेजेस इन विलेजेस इन इट रिझल्ट्स in drought like conditions it also reflects into loss of agricultural produce therefore the massa- message about saving water or to make judicious use of water should be spread far and wide the solar energy is renewable energy option which is very easily available in country like india by using solar energy we can replace the polluting and exhaustible fuels thereby pollution of will be also reduced due to such symbols important message about environment conservation reach us and we can change ourselves into more eco friendly person thank you so much for watching our video mitranno sir ha video avadla sat ta yala nakki like kara tu sha mitra mitra nanda share kara mhanje jasa sodya tata pan pahta yil ani tumhala jar kutlahi prashna ya dhadya madhe adat asel ta avala nakki comment kar vichara tat kahi harkat nahi ami tumhala pratyek prashna cha uttar deu agdi chote chote shanka asle tari ami tumhala tya prashna cha uttar deu ani sapna sanskruting channel subscribe kara pan je amche channel var se nav navin video tumhala pahta yete dhanyawad